Hi, we're here at the Miami Short Film Festival. I'm Alana Taylor, and who am I with today? I, I am Louis Aleman, filmmaker and uh, director of Tigerit. And tell us about Tigerit. What did, what did you work on in this project? So in this project, it was a, basically a three-week process of animation. And it was just write a story, figure something out. So I wanted to talk about something about my life, a personal story. Uh, growing up in Miami, I knew a lot about graffiti. Uh, my past has been a lot about painting and doing realism. And animation was a new medium that I figured out. And I did a story that had to do a little bit about my past. So, so you were the animator for this film? Yeah, so I directed and animated this film. Uh, I had another person that helped me as well, Alexandra Paglieri. She did a lot of the animation work as well, so we were able to work as a team as well, so yeah. And what's the story about? So the story is about two girls who um, basically start graffiti. They're, they're basically, it's one little girl that's trying to learn how to graffiti, and there's this one big mentor, and she's up there, and she's teaching her how to graffiti on the walls and everything. And then, all of a sudden, there's a cop that shows up. Mm. Oh no! They go on a chase, they, go, they start running, they do parkour. Will they be able to escape the cops? And so you go into this thrilling adventure, a really, really nice adventure of them running through the city as they try to escape the cops, basically, so yeah. And well, how did your love for graffiti come about? Were you very little? Was it recently? What's this graffiti story? Yeah, so growing up in Miami, graffiti's everywhere. Everyone knows if you grew up in Miami, you'll see graffiti on the sidewalks, you'll see it on buildings. And as a little kid, that's something that interested me in visual arts a lot. Um, I saw it as, a, as an art. A lot of people saw it as vandalism. But for me, it was a way of expressing yourself. And I didn't think it would cause much harm, you know, graffiti a couple things here and there. Mm -hmm. And so, um, yeah, it was, graffiti was kind of an introduction for me to visual arts. So um, I started off really young doing graffiti, so yeah. And what made you go into animation? So animation was basically something that I discovered very recently. Um, when I started applying for colleges, I was going into art schools. I was trying to apply for visual arts because I did a lot of painting, but then I saw Florida State University had a College of Motion Picture Arts and I thought, that's interesting. I mean, I've always done paintings in the past. What is animation? I mean, it's a new medium of art and I felt that I could express myself better through animation. I feel like there was more opportunities as an artist to grow. So, and how long did this project take you when you decided that you were going to do it to completion? Yeah. yeah, so, well, it started off as an, as, a, as an idea. It was always in the back of my head. I knew I wanted to do something that had to involve graffiti. So it was always something that was in the back of my head. Well, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do. But then the script just kind of came to me. It was just kind of like, well, I've had a little experience like this, you know? Mm -hmm. And I, kinda, I was like, I, I want to bring this up. And I thought it was a pretty cool topic to talk about. And I wrote the script in about a month. And ma the actual process of making it took me about three weeks. It was a pretty quick wow, process. Wow, three so. weeks. Tell us a little bit about the ups and downs of those three weeks. Oh, like. yeah. <laughs> so it was my first ever being a director, uh -huh. animating on a film. Uh -huh. It was first everything. So it was uh -huh. a completely new thing. It wasn't like painting at all. I was very surprised. I was like, oh, this is a lot. But I stood my ground. Um, my partner, Alex, also, like, she was able to help me a lot through the process. Um, and so it was basically a lot of just hitting the wall, crashing. Oh, this didn't work. Oh my God, this is not the process of how to do a film. Uh -huh. um, Re rewriting the script as we're going along and it was a lot of just like figuring it out it was, as a first time director it was something that was new to me so did you know you were going to submit it or it was just a passion project it was mostly a passion project it was really nothing i wasn't really it was something that i knew i wanted to get out of this mm -hmm. and um my professors at the film school also just told me just go for it you know and so yeah. Yeah, it was something that it was it really, I just went for it. And so it kind of worked out, so yeah. That's fantastic. Well, congratulations. Um, hoping to see it at the Miami Short Film Festival yeah. and that everything goes well. Awesome, thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you for having me.